we have 60 minus 40. So starting on 60, we can place 60 at the end of our number line, because that's the number we're subtracting from. And we're subtracting 40, which is 4 tens. So if we subtract 1 ten, we have 50. Subtract 2 tens, and we have 40. Subtract 3 tens, and we have 30. And subtract 4 tens, and we have 20. So we've subtracted 10 four times, or we've subtracted four lots of 10. So 60 take away 40 is 20. And if we know that 6 minus 4 is 2, then we know that 6 tens minus 4 tens is 2 tens, or 20. Now 50 take away 30. So we start with 50. So let's write 50 at the end of our number line. And we're subtracting 30, which is 3 tens. So if we subtract 1 ten, we have 40. If we subtract 2 tens, we have 30. And subtract 3 tens, and we have 20. So we've subtracted 10 three times, or we've subtracted three lots of 10, which is 30. So 50 take away 30 is 20. And if we were subtracting units, we would know that 5 minus 3 is 2. So we're subtracting 10s. So 50 is 5 tens, 30 is 3 tens, so that leaves us with 2 tens, which is 20. Now, 80 subtract 60 on a number line. So if we're subtracting 60, we're subtracting 10 6 times. So subtract 10, and we have 70. Subtract 2 tens, or 20, altogether and we have 60. Subtract 30, and we have 50. Subtract 4 tens, or 40, and we have 40. Subtract 5 tens, or 50, and we have 30. And subtract 6 tens, or 60, and we're left with 20. So we've subtracted 60, because we've counted back in tens six times. So 80 take away 60 is 20. But we don't really need a number line to work this out. How could you subtract 60 from 80 mentally? Well, if you know that 8 minus 6 is 2, then you know that 80 take away 60 is 20. Now we have 90 take away 50 on a number line. So if we're subtracting 50, we need to count back in tens how many times? Well, 50 is 5 tens, so we need to go back 5 tens. So if we go back 10, we get to 80. Go back two tens, and we get to 70. Back three tens, and we have 60. Four tens, and we have 50. And now back five tens gives us 40. So we've subtracted 50, because we've subtracted 10 five times. And five tens make 50. So 90 minus 50 is 40. And how could we calculate that mentally without a number line? Well, if we know that 9 minus 5 is 4, we can be sure that 9 tens minus 5 tens 
is for tens or 40.